Good morning, Cristina. Gabriella. So today we are in the, at the Cordon Bleu School in Florence and uh, we are um, cooking something. And so what would you like to have, Cristina, today? I would like something uh, fresh, color, that reminds me summertime. Okay, so I have thought uh, a citrus pesto that uh, includes uh, a citrus fruit now we uh, at the end of the season but very very nice and colorful and uh, orange and lemon and almonds capers basil mm. and mint so i i'm sure that you will like it so let's let's make it okay. can you help me yes of course So let's start. We have here very, very good organic oranges, very good lemons, organic lemons. Then we have almonds with the skin on, capers uh, without the salt, um, basil, fresh basil, and mint. This kind of pesto can be used in many different ways. So it, it can be kept in the refrigerator in a jar covered with oil and can be used for pasta as a pasta sauce, uh, for bruschetta, to put on bruschetta, adding tomatoes or eggplants, uh, or also um, on top of uh, roast beef to give a nice flavor. So let's make it, it's very simple to make. The pesto. Mm. Can I taste? Can I taste, please, Gabriella? Please. Mm. I like the taste. Mm. You like it? Nice. Good. Oh, good. Very good. Very good. <laughs> how, lo how long we can keep in the fridge? How long? Uh, in the fridge, like this, for about a uh, um, couple of weeks. But you can deep freeze it. Mm. So it can, uh, it can keep, we can keep for two months. No problem. Perfect for me. If you want to make pasta with this pesto, you can add something else, like uh, fresh uh, cherry tomatoes, uh, uh, pan fried, 
uh, or stir fry with garlic uh, or um, um, eggplants uh, or tuna fish, mm. fresh tuna diced, everything saute in a pan and you can add this uh, as a, a flavor enhancer.